Afternoon, Kodja Geeker here. I have to say, I can remember a time when there were no computer games at all. We used to play with Batmobiles and uh, Evil Knievel's uh, gyroscopic motorbike. But I was there at the beginning, from Pong through to the 70s consoles, 80s games computers like the Spectrum, etc. I had all of them. Got my first PCs in the 90s. But then, after children came along, I hung on for a while with the PlayStation 1, 2, 3 and uh, the Xbox and Xbox 360 and Xbox One. But eventually gave up because I just couldn't compete with them. However, as it's lockdown, for my birthday, my lads bought me TT Racer 2. It's probably not its proper name. I'll pull this proper name up. And uh, I was quite impressed by the way that uh, it gave me the feeling of being back on the Isle of Man. So I put together a few clips of the mountain track just to compare, just to compare the reality to the simulation. And I think all things considered, they did a good job. Obviously, it doesn't compare with the real thing. Well, not exactly. But as I haven't left the house since March the 21st, I've really enjoyed it. I listened to Nevesy on MCN as well, and I've been trying to use his uh, race techniques on the game. I have to say it's helped, but I'm still useless. the road this road that's interesting traction control kicks in there and I'm in slip nine anyway where are we bungalow <laughs> drop down down blip off close visor and go Seven. This is heaven, what a place!
mountain road, sunshine, perfect surface and just for a time there some open road. Oh. I can die happy, <laughs> but not today hopefully. The Craig. Anyway, thanks for watching. Card your biker is out.